Hey, how's it going guys? It's Tom Mason here. And today I've got a really exciting quick video. And that is about this, the brand new Nikon 800 millimeter S line prime. Now I've had the super awesome opportunity to be up here in the Finnish Arctic to test this lens out pre-release. And I just want to do a little video to give you some first impressions, talk you through how I can see this being used and why it's something that I think loads of Nikon shooters are really going to want to add to their bag. Now to get started, I think firstly, this is gonna be the first time that we're really getting the chance to have access to the 800 mm focal length that is gonna enable wildlife photographers to really make the most of it. The whole lens is design is really about that flexibility in terms of its weight and performance. I've been using this handheld pretty much the whole time we've been up in the Arctic. You know, we've been on the back of snowmobiles, driving around. I've had to react quickly to the subjects that are out in front of me. The fact that I can just hold it one hand, no problem, is extremely useful when you're working with subjects that are moving quickly. It's given me the ability to get low on the ground, crawl around with a lens out in front of me with no problems whatsoever. Many of you who have seen my other videos will know that I'm used to a 300 mil prime. This is absolutely no heavier than that in terms of the way that I'm shooting and working. In terms of its actual use, I actually think this is much easier to work with uh, in some ways than my 300 mil. That really is certainly very nice. The optics and quality from the S-Line glass is superb. I think the images that are coming out of this are absolutely beautiful. And of course, it features all the bells and whistles that would be used to with any top Nikon uh, prime telephoto lens. Absolutely love the gold ring that's back as well. I think the way it's weighted is superb. You know, with a Z9 on the back, it's very, very well balanced. That makes it comfortable to use all day. If you're working handheld with a monopod, whatever, it's really gonna be great for that sort of shooting. I think for many wildlife photographers who just need that extra reach for small birds, little subjects, or just don't want to encroach on their subjects to kind of, you know, get a bit near and disturb them, this is gonna be a lens that many of us are really going to want to reach for. And I think it's gonna be the first time that many of us are gonna have the access to this kind of lens. Other than that, it's just the way it's been performing. It's just worked perfectly. Focus is fast, quick, locks onto my subjects. And with the Z9 on the back, it's really just working very well. The video focus is something that I've really been impressed by. I think my older VR lenses don't have the, the just quality that this does for that video tracking. And certainly when I wanted to grab little clips of the animals that we've been seeing here in the Arctic, it's really worked astonishingly. The vibration reduction as well, another feature that's just great when it's paired with the new mirrorless cameras. I think this is gonna be a game changer for loads of us wildlife photographers who wanna get close, wanna get those unique views, I want a lens that's also lightweight, portable, and it's gonna make wildlife photography that a bit more comfortable and very enjoyable to get out and do. 